Hello Scorpios, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. Let's see what's going on with you guys at this time. Check out the description box below for any sort of personal readings. Follow me on Instagram, all that great stuff. So let's see what's going on with you guys. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Venus sign. I'm tired. I feel like you guys are tired of something, right? Right. I'm tired. I'm tired of going back and forth. I'm tired of trying to figure out what's going on here. I'm try I'm I'm trying, but I'm tired, right? Uh this energy of feeling depleted, all right? A, a strong energy of feeling depleted, possibly dealing with somebody that may be in this energy of pretending, putting on a mask, right? This could be somebody that may be acting as if they are not missing you. All right. But I feel like this person is here and I feel like a lot of you guys know that, but I feel like it's just a cycle for a lot of you guys. And I feel like for some, it's like I'm more so tired. I'm, I'm looking for some sort of clarity. I'm looking for the truth. I want the truth in a situation. There's something that you guys were not getting the truth about and you just want somebody to confess, right? Confess how you feel about me. Confess how you um, what you're hiding, right? You feel like somebody's possibly been hiding something, not being open been not being honest right and I feel like you guys possibly put a lot of energy into this and now I feel like Scorpio you may be missing somebody maybe feeling a lot of love for somebody but it's like I have to pretend now I have to pretend that I don't want to speak to you I have to pretend that I don't miss you and I do but I have to pretend right because I don't want to possibly be vulnerable or I don't want to push you away whatever it may be I feel like this is something that you guys are not wanting to do because it's really not in your nature but I feel like it's one of those things where it's like I don't have a choice here okay but I do get this energy of somebody longing for somebody right longing for somebody to reach out longing for somebody to just confess their love right it's like something about this person's touch something about this person's energy that really brings you into this place of nostalgia like mm, okay so let's see what's going on here Scorpio so so let's see what's going on with you and this person here Okay. Wow. A lot of secrets. All right. So somebody here is holding back, right? Holding back, not giving up the goods in a sense, if you understand at some point here. Okay. So somebody here is not opening up. You feel like somebody's being very quiet towards you. This person's not being honest, not being upfront. All right. Somebody could just be trying to hold back. And it's like this person knows that you miss them. Look at, look at the two pals in the back here. All right. This is somebody here that knows the truth. All right. And I feel like Scorpio, you're so tired of this game, right? I'm so tired of playing this game here. I'm so tired of um, playing with, with you here. And I feel like a lot of you guys may be just holding back from this person as well, right? This is somebody that wonders like, is Scorpio going to reach out? Are you going to reach out? Am I going to reach out? It, it's, it's like this Who's going to open up first here, right? But the connection is so strong. It's like when we come together, we have this passion, right? We have this love. We have this strong connection, right? That both of us cannot deny at all here, right? Both of us cannot deny this. This is something we can't deny. But again, I feel like someone here brings this energy of game playing, right? acting as if I don't want this. This is not something I want to fight for. This is not something I want to work for. And Scorpio, I feel like you're fed up. Okay. I feel like you guys may be in this energy of feeling fed up here. Okay. But again, we're going to look into this and see what's going on. All right. There may be some secrets here. All right. Something going on here that we need to clarify. All right. What is it that we need to clarify here? Okay. For some of you guys in the past here, I feel like past relationships, past careers have really taken a toll on you guys, right? Like I've just been so tired. I've been so tired of trying to get my point across in love here. I'm tired of trying to find somebody that understands me. I'm tired. I'm really tired of running into these energies, right? Yeah. Somebody here is... It's like, I feel like some of you guys really just stepped into this energy of healing. Something here happened in somebody's past that really put them in this energy of healing, 
okay? So I feel like one thing that you guys are definitely tired of is being the person that's always trying to work on a relationship, right? Being the person that's always trying to reach out, try to fix something, trying to communicate with someone here. But I do feel like someone here in the past have been so disappointed in love. I've been so disappointed that all I could do is nothing. <laughs> yeah. And this could also be your person as well here. Because I feel like this is someone here that really doesn't communicate, right? It, it's like they don't communicate. Although at times here they come in running in, right? Because they do have a lot of passion. A lot of passion here. But at the same time, this is somebody that's guarded. It's like, I have passion for you, Scorpio, but I'm a bit guarded. I'm a bit guarded. I don't know if I'm ready to be vulnerable here. It's like they come in, but they're not able to really profess their love for you here. Okay? It's like they're talking with the Eight of Wands. There's communication, but they're not really saying much. Okay? There's like this lack of vulnerability that you guys may feel to some extent here. Okay? Give me some more. Okay, they don't want that. <laughs> don't want that. Scorpios, please. There we go. Yeah. Keeping me stuck here. Wow. Scorpio. This is someone here I feel like that you truly cannot get off of your mind. Okay, I can't get you out of my mind and I'm feeling stuck. I feel like I'm not too sure what to do about the situation. I keep thinking about you, right? I keep thinking about you. I, I think about you all the time. I think about our connection. I think about our love. But I also think about our issues, right? I think about my fears, all right? This, you're dealing also with someone here that I feel like isn't really putting much into a connection. I feel like someone here may not be trying as much as you want them to try, right? They're not really trying. They're not bringing in the truth here, okay? This person may be stuck in, a, in another situation or stuck in a mindset of, I'm not going to put my heart on my sleeves because I've been hurt before, right? This could be somebody that you're currently dealing with, Scorpio, where they're afraid of being hurt, so they have to be in control, right? New energy here. All right, so take that how that resonates. So a lot of you guys may be dealing with a new energy that may just started for a lot of you guys. Other Others here, I feel like this is just a situation that you're feeling like you're ready to give up on, all right, due to the uh, demand on your energy, right, and the lack of clarity that this is bringing in here. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. So this is someone here, could be Aries energy, could be dealing with a Taurus here. Taurus Cancer, but I do feel like you guys may be dealing with somebody here that has this, nothing is a problem, nothing bothers me, right? Nothing bothers me here. This is somebody that may be uh, some sort of boss or has a boss type energy, right? Attractive, confident, but they pretend a lot, right? There's a big pretending energy in terms of this person doesn't really show you exactly what is going on internally, right? This person acts as if everything is fine. They're not worried, all right? This person could be a father, okay? But I feel like this person, it's like they try to act like they're not focused on you, but they are here, okay? They're still holding on to you, Scorpio. But I feel like you guys are just trying to make a decision about this connection because this person looks just so unbothered, you know what I mean? This person looks so unbothered here so unbothered but again though i feel like this is somebody that's afraid of really showing their true colors showing their vulnerability right it seems like this person was possibly seems like this person was possibly hurt in the past here or this person went through some sort of betrayal here okay or this could be this person's fear i'm fear i fear losing i fear you exposing me i fear being vulnerable is what I'm seeing with this person, all right? Just a lot of fears, but this person is very good at masking their energy, all right? They could be still in another situation but that they may not be speaking about, still dealing with a lot of people, but just protecting themselves, right? So they have this um, protective armor on, okay? A lot of you guys, all right. Wow. Thank you. 
But I feel like you guys are somewhat setting yourself free. I feel like you guys are so tired of the games because Scorpios, I feel like you guys just want love, right? I want a new beginning. And this is something that this person is going to start understanding with time. Like Scorpio wants love, right? And Scorpio is not going to keep on going back and forth with you here because I feel like you guys are going to make it clear that this is what I want and I'm not able to pretend with you. You understand? I can't pretend here. Let me get a few energies here in terms of what's going on. How is this person feeling towards my Scorpios at this time? How is this person feeling, please? So we have phone call and we have new beginnings here. All right. So this may be somebody reaching out to you, trying to talk to you, trying to um, see if there's a chance of possibly starting something new with you. All right. Could be dealing with an Aries again. All right. But a lot of pretending energy. I pretend not to care. I pretend not to care here. All right. So let's see how this person's feeling about you, Scorpio. How do they feel? How do they feel? How is this person feeling about my beautiful Scorpio, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Venus signs? I will never forget unspoken feelings and celebration. So this is somebody that wants to actually have some sort of happiness with you here, right? But I feel like this person wants you to chase. It's like they want you to do the work here, all right? Because I don't feel like this person... Um, doesn't think about you. I feel like this person definitely thinks about you, but I don't talk about my feelings, right? I don't really express my feelings. I don't express how I feel, all right? Which is why we're here, you know? But I feel like this person may not express their their desires, right? There's just a lot of fears in this person's energy, all right? Give me Scorpio's feelings, please. Scorpio. Awakening. Yeah, you guys are getting you know, this wake up call of I'm done. I'm so tired of playing this game, honestly, right? This awakening. This is how I feel. This is what I want. This is what I'm seeking. This is what I want in a relationship. This is what I want with you or anybody that's available at this time that's willing to move into this direction of new love here. Okay, so I feel like you guys are getting this sort of clarity that this person may be pretending that this person does have feelings, but this person has an ego uh, guard on, right? Or a guard that really just brings a lot of pain and a lot of secrets into a connection here. So some of you guys may have found out the truth about somebody or found out the truth about this person's energy, right? Found out that this person's possibly um, keeping something from you, but I feel like you guys are more so moving into this energy of I'm getting I'm getting a a better understanding of what I should do here with this person. So I feel like you guys are definitely going to possibly express to your to this person how you're feeling and if you don't speak to this person, I feel like it's one of those things where it's like it doesn't matter if I speak to this person or not. I'm wanting to really just indulge in self-love, right? And freeing myself because I feel like in the past here, someone here was very stuck trying to figure out how someone was feeling as they kept, you know, being very secretive, be being very closed off, right? Pulling back. It's like when I wanted to see you, I don't know, you know, I feel like for some of you guys, it's like when you wanted to see this person, this person would pull back or this person would have an excuse. All right. So let's see what we could expect moving forward here. What could we expect moving forward with my beautiful Scorpios? What could we expect with this energy? And for a lot of you guys, I feel like the more you pull back, the more you're actually going to get the truth of this connection. I'm going to find out the truth, right? The more this person realizes that they're losing you, the more that this person's going to uh, put their guard down is what I'm feeling, okay? Because again, we have this pretending energy here. But again, this is somebody that feels this connection. Put my Scorpios expect here. All right. So we have slow movement. All right. So a lot of you guys may be taking this slow and someone here looks like they're stressing, right? Stressing about the pace here, but realizing that this is the best way to go. All right. For a lot of you guys, it probably really hurts to hold back from this person, but you're realizing this is what I have to do. It's what I have to do. Okay. Yeah. 
giving myself a lot of self-love. We have Queen of Cups two times here. So a lot of you guys are really focused on showing this person how to love you, right? And I feel like this is something that stepped in once you started really healing and pulling back and just sitting in your, your silence, all right? Sitting in that energy of just protecting your, your divinity and not really just allowing someone to toy with you here, okay? Not allowing anybody to toy with you. Yep, a truth comes out. Something is expressed to you, Scorpio. And I'm telling you, I feel like this person expresses how they feel. Yep, here this person comes in expressing how they feel so for a lot of you guys you might have some sort of encounter with this individual and they're going to have to make a decision but i feel like there's some sort of encounter that happens once you blow the whistle on this and you blow the yeah you blow the whistle on this and you say hey that's it i feel like this person comes running in right running in um with a lot of passion with a lot of communication so a lot of you guys may start getting communication from this person here Okay, once they realize that you are no longer playing their game, right? It's like you're pulling the rug under their under their game or their foot, right? However they say it. All right, give me some more here. Thank you. Yeah, some of you guys, wow, strong connection here. This is one of the things that you start realizing. Okay, a lot of you guys may be dealing with a Gemini here. One of the things that you start to realize, Scorpio, is that this is a mutually you know strong connection we both feel like this with each other we do but why are you so scared right why is this person so scared why is this person blocking this out why is this person acting as if this is not what they want here and i feel like you're going to start picking up on this acting energy okay because trust and believe this is somebody that does long for you but i feel like they're trying to push away this connection Okay, for some of you guys, again, this person may be dealing with other people, just not taking this very seriously. Okay, give me this person's actions. Again, Aries energy, very guarded. <laughs> this person is very, this person doesn't want you to know how they feel. I feel like this person's very, very protective of their emotions. I will not let Scorpio know that I'm stressing. I will not Scorp I will not let Scorpio know how I truly feel, right? I have to come off like I'm not worried, I'm protected. I have to pretend here. Okay? But someone here, it's like they're hiding their truth. They're afraid of being vulnerable. They're afraid of you seeing that side of of them, that deep side of them. Okay? Let me see more about this person more about this person please nope Scorpio please ooh fireworks Scorpio wow so this is somebody here that wants to reconcile have a new beginning with you okay don't be surprised if this person comes in wanting to have a conversation wanting to start over with you here okay wanting to start lightly here again all right. I feel like this person's running out of um, options, running out of um, skits or games or excuses. All right. Confused here. Once you decide to pull away from this person, this person just steps into this energy of being very confused, Scorpio. Like, how does Scorpio feel about me? How is Scorpio thinking? What What is going on with Scorpio? Okay. Once you guys decided to reconcile with yourself, all right, and really focus on yourself here, okay? I feel like someone here gets exposed. Yep. Thank you. This person really comes back in. But again, I will say take it very slow with this person. Okay, Scorpio, take it very slow with this individual here. All right? Be sure that this person is moving with their mouth and, and what I mean by that is um, make sure that this person is not just performing right it's like one minute they want one thing and the next they're unsure what they want it's like they talk about change and the next minute they talk about nothing so be sure that this person is moving in a proper way here okay because I feel like someone here is not being honest about change and I feel like it is because of fear 
All right. I will talk to you guys soon. Have an amazing one. I love you guys. All right. Bye.